Hello. It is February 12th, 2021, a Friday. The weather here looks fine. Low 44, high 61. Gonna get some rain. It's welcome. We don't get enough of that around here. Today, I'm gonna keep it short. I just wanted to do a little show and tell. You may have seen this in some of the scenes I've shot here in my shop. It is Java the Hut. This was a pinata. It's obviously a used pinata. I made this for my son's birthday. It shows what you can do with very little. I mean, look at this guy. Proud of him. His little chubby hands, eyes, the crooked nose. That's characteristic of Java. It's just paper mache. It's just ripped up newspaper, water and flour, and and some time. I think a lot of people think of it as just like a, a kid's craft material, not something serious makers and certainly not artists would use. But I've done some fun stuff with it. I created Java's Palace, a, a diorama playset. I did the dungeon part of that, the Rancor part, with paper mache over top of a wood frame. And if you put enough layers and a good coat of paint, it's incredibly durable. It feels solid. He's been playing with it for well over a year now and it doesn't show a lick of wear. It's good stuff. Highly recommend digging in and doing it. It's another material or a medium that any maker can use that doesn't require a fancy tool shop or expensive equipment. I love the idea of accessible making and as much as I enjoy my fancy tools, it's, it's great to just do something that you can do on the kitchen table. It's terrific. Have a great Friday everyone.